President Irfan Ali visited the family of slain youth Harish Singh in Region 5 as they prepared to lay the body to rest. More from Narima Ali. 17-year-old Harry Singh of No. 3 Village on the west coast of Burbis was one of the three young boys who were fatally beaten. Today, September 23, 2020, the Singh family prepared to lay his body to rest. While at the Prasad's funeral parlor at Charlotte Street, New Amsterdam, the family was met by the President of the Cooperative Republic, Mr. Mohammed Ali. He sympathized with the grieving family members, after which he spoke briefly with the media. I believe that the Guyana Police Force, with the support that we have requested from uh, the regional institution and from uh, the British government, would allow us to bring all these criminals who perpetrated this, these acts to justice. But I think a lot of our focus now, in memory of these three young men, has to be on healing. It has to be on bringing our country together. It has to be on unifying our efforts and ensuring that all Guyanese, that our future does not have repeat of these horrific uh, incidents. The president also promised his government's commitment in ensuring peace and tranquility so that the past does not repeat itself. My government is going to work day in and day out to bring our people together through policies and programs, to bring our people together through social efforts. Marking of culture, I think, is important in creating that Guyanese identity, ensuring that social safety nets are there for the vulnerable in our society. We have to do these things in addition to ensuring justice to serve for these three young men. We have to reflect on these incidents and ensure that we build mechanisms in our society, ensure that we strengthen our society and strengthen our resolve in ensuring this was not for again in our history. In closing, he said, But today I think is a day for us to reflect. Today is a day for us to remember these families in our prayers, remember the Harage families family today in our prayers and to recommit ourselves individually and collectively to a Guyana that will be better and a Guyana in which unity will be there. That is the most and the best thing we can do in memory of these two young men. The management and staff of DTV8 and Channel 8 News extends sincere condolences to the family and friends of Harish Singh. Marima Ali, Channel 8 News.